Hello, my name is Steve Bowler, and in this video we're going to be taking a look at Layer 2 troubleshooting. And so what we're going to do in this lab is give you a couple of trouble tickets, and we have induced a couple problems into the Layer 2 domain. So what we're going to do is take a look at how to resolve some common Layer 2 issues that you might see in the real world also you might see these when you are taking Cisco exams so for the CCNA or the CCMP T-shoot even at the CCIE routing switching troubleshooting area so as you can see we have a pretty simple network diagram we have switch 1 emulated by the cloud we also have switch 2 emulated by another cloud we have an 802.1 Q trunk between switch 1 and switch 2 over port FA014 on both sides and then we also have four hosts host 1, host 3, host 2 and host 4 host 2 and 4 are off of switch 2 and host 1 and 3 are off of switch 1 both host 1 and host 2 are in VLAN 12 and host 3 and host 4 are in VLAN 34 So again, host 1 connects to switch 1 via FA01, host 3 via FA03, host 2 is connected to switch 2, FA02, and host 4 to switch 2, FA04. So let's go ahead and take a look at our first trouble ticket. Also, I'm sorry, before we do that, as you can see in the very top left, we have the VLANs. VLAN 12 is host 1 and 2. VLAN 34, host 3 and 4 are part of VLAN 34. Again, VLAN 34 is 192.168.34.0 slash 24 network, and VLAN 12 is the 192.168.12.0 slash 24 network. So now that we have a detailed description of our network topology, let's go ahead and take a look at the first trouble ticket. Again, this is Layer 2 Troubleshooting Lab 1. Our first ticket reads that after upgrading Switch 1 and Switch 2 to a new switch to new switch platforms, Host 1 is having problems reaching Host 2. Both hosts are in VLAN 12. After further investigation, it appears as though none of this should be the after further investigation, it appears as though none of the hosts on Switch 1 have connectivity to hosts on Switch 2. Configure the network so that Host 1 can ping Host 2. So this has given us some good information. We know that there was an upgrade performed between Switch 1 and 2. They were upgraded to new Switch platforms. It doesn't specify what the Switch platform is. Also, it's telling us that not only can host 1 ping host 2, but none of the hosts on switch 1 can ping any hosts on switch 2. So we have isolated connectivity between switch 1 and switch 2. So the first thing that we want to do when troubleshooting layer 2 is we want to make sure that the hosts, in this case, we have just routers that